हेलो स्टूडेंट्स एंड वेलकम बैक टू आवर डिजिटल क्लास सो स्टूडेंट्स हाउ आर यू आई होप यू हैव डूइंग वेरी वेल एंड आई एम असिस्टेंट टीचर ऑफ विनायक शिक्षा मंदिर एंड क्लास टीचर ऑफ क्लास वन सो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी विल लर्न क्लास वन भल्यूम वन सब्जेक्ट इविएस लेसन नंबर थ्री एंड द टॉपिक नेम इज स्कीप काउंटिंग सो लेट्स गो टू द वीडियो What do you mean by skip counting? Skip counting is simple. Let's take an example. Let's see somebody waiting for us. <gasps> That cute little rabbit. Do you know he wants to go and eat those carrots. He is very hungry. So, but we can help this rabbit go and reach the carrots. He has to cross a number line, many numbers in front of him. So. You know what he's going to do? He's going to take jump leaps. Okay, means he's going to do a big jump. He will leave one number in the middle, and he will reach on the second number. Look at that. We have the numbers from zero to ten there. Now he will skip one and reach on two. Skip three, reach on four. Where will he jump now? On five? On seven? Mm -mm. On six? And now on eight? And then on ten? Wow! Another one jump and you reach your carrots! Yippee! The rabbit reached the carrots and he got to eat them. What did he do? Do you know what he did? He skipped by two. When you mean you let go one number and reach on the second number, got it? That is why when you jumped or the when the rabbit jumped from zero to two, he left one and he reached on two. Then left three, reached on four. What did he leave to reach on six? Five. You're right. Now, when he reached on eight, he left seven, and finally, when he reached on ten, he left the nine. Now, children, tell me, when he was on ten and he jumped on the carrots, which number do you think he jumped on? Twelve. You're right. And what did he skip in between? Eleven. Because he just skipped by two, okay. And this skipping is called skip counting. Why is it called skip counting? Because you are leaving one number in the middle and you're continuing to count, okay. This was skip counting by two. Ready to see another one? Let's see what is skip counting by five. Skip counting by five is nothing but skipping how many numbers? Four numbers and reaching on the fifth number. Excellent. Now whom do we have here? Knock knock. Uh oh, you little Tommy. Tommy seems hungry. Did you see him licking his lips? Running and going to fetch what? The bone. Mm. Dogs just can't stop themselves. They want to eat the bones immediately. They will lick it, bite it, especially the puppies. Do you know? But did you see? Tommy is somewhere, and the bone is somewhere. He has many numbers, and he has to cross a long number line. He doesn't want to skip by two. Because he thinks skipping by two will only make his wait longer. He does not want to wait so long. He wants to quickly go and grab the bone. 
So he decided that he will skip count by five. He will leave away four numbers and go and land on the fifth number. So he started. There you go, Tommy. Run. And he ran faster. He reached five. Then he reached ten. Then he reached fifteen. And finally reached twenty. And caught hold of his bones. <laughs> mm, yummy, yummy. My bone is so yummy. Wasn't that nice? Didn't Tommy reach really faster? So what should you do? If you want to count something quickly, you should skip count. For example, I ask you how many tiles are there in your room. You will count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. If you have 5 tiles below one another, you would quickly skip and say 10. And then skip and say 15. Reach to 20. And after that... 25, leave 4, leave 26, 27, 28 and 29. Where did you reach now? 30, 30 days in a month. You're right. Now, Tommy is so happy because you just helped him skip count by 5 and reach his bone really, really fast. Okay, like Tommy being very, very happy. Do you want to see who else is happy? Of course you, because you are learning something new. You just learned how to skip count by two and then skip count by five. Let's do a quick recap. When you skip counted by two, what did you do? You left one number in the middle. Correct? You did not count one. When you were at zero, you didn't say one. You said two. And then you said 4, and then you said 6, 8, 10, 12, and so on. When you skip counted by 5, you first said 5, then 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. You can go on and on. Aren't you enjoying doing this? I am loving teaching you. Let's do one more. Okay. Do you know kangaroos? Oh, what's a kangaroo? It's an animal that you find in a country called Australia. Okay. They are huge animals and you can jump really very, very high. They can take huge steps. Okay. So here was this little kangaroo, Joey. The baby of a kangaroo is called a joey. Okay, what is he called? Joey. So Joey wanted to reach his mother. Wanted to go quickly and sit in his mother's pouch. Okay, do you know kangaroos keep their babies in their pouch? They have a bag attached to their stomach, to the tummy. The mama always has her baby in her tummy. Okay, and that tummy pouch is a safe place for the little Joey. Until Joey grows big, Mama always has Joey in her tummy. Okay? And it's called a pouch. So, Joey is waiting to get into Mama's pouch because he's very, very sleepy. He's very, very tired. He played for a very long time, you see. So, now Joey has decided, I cannot wait and count to skip count till two. I am not skip counting by 5. I will skip count by 10. And so he skips from 1 to 9 and reaches on 10. Then from 11 to 19 is skipped and he reaches on 20. So 10, 20, 30. And he reaches mommy. Yay! Joey baby, go to sleep while we skip count until 100. 100? Oh, you don't have to say 31, 32, 33 and so on. 
Just say 40 and then 50, 60, 70, 80, 90 and 100. Wonderful. Can you count after 100? Skip count for me after 100 please. Let's skip count by 2. You would say 102. 104, 106, 108, 110. Stop. Skip count by 5. 105, 110, 115, 120. Yippee! Now you're so good with skip counting by five also. Now quickly, let's go faster, faster, faster. Skip count by ten. One hundred and thirty, one hundred and forty, one hundred and fifty, one hundred and sixty, one hundred and seventy, one hundred and eighty. 190, 200, yay, from 0 to 200, such a less time, amazing little children, so what do you do when you have to count faster, you just skip count, remember skip count is a wonderful thing. So students, I hope you all have understood the topic and your homework is read this about lesson again and again and activity book page number 42 and 43 and workbook page number 29 so students thank you so much